Hi, I'm Gloria, coordinator with the City of Brampton, and I'm happy to take you along the virtual tour of your Fletcher's West neighborhood. Here are some details about the area, including who your local councillors are. I'll take you around the neighborhood to visit six neighborhood gems, and we'll also be joined by other program partners and city staff. Brampton will be an age-friendly community that meets the needs of all ages and abilities, and the Flower City Community Campus has something to offer for everyone. There are outdoor recreational fields to stay active, and a community garden to help nourish residents and local food banks. One unique gem about the FCC campus is the Bob Callahan Flower City Senior Center. Let's hear more about this facility from recreation team member, Alicia. Welcome to the Bob Callahan Flower City Senior Center. This community center is centrally located in the city of Brampton at the southwest corner of McLaughlin Road and Queen Street West. Minutes from downtown Brampton and easily accessible by public transit. This unique facility in Brampton offers a variety of indoor and outdoor amenities with a large gymnasium, auditorium, dance studio, hobby shop, craft room, ceramics room, and billiards room to keep you physically, mentally, and socially active throughout the year. Recreational activities such as crafts, sports, group fitness, and educational classes that will get you moving and engaging with others. The center also offers skill training through computer classes and other learning sessions. Social activities are in abundance in this facility. You can find pool tables, community rooms, and a snack bar. The City of Brampton has implemented enhanced safety measures to ensure the well-being of the public and city staff. Please visit the City's Recreation webpage for further updates. The Bob Callahan Flower City Senior Center has something for everyone, and we look forward to seeing you soon. Stop 2 brings us to the milestones of Labour Monument. Here's more from Heather. Hello! Today I'm in the neighbourhood of Fletcher's West in the area of McLaughlin and Queen where you will find the Milestones of Labour Monument. The Milestones of Labour Monument was a community-built sculpture that commemorates union accomplishments, promotes health and safety, and celebrates work. The sculpture, completed in 2013, depicts three life-size figures of different ages, genders, and ethnic backgrounds carrying a rainbow reflector that projects a colourful band of light upon the plaque marking the National Day of Mourning, held every April 28th. It's a place to meet, remember, and honour those Peel Region workers injured who had lost their lives in the workplace. This is a place for education, healing, and reflection on the nature of work and its relation to community. So come out and explore Brampton's astounding neighbourhoods by learning more at brampton.ca forward slash neighbourhoods. While on your walk, our program partners from the region of Peel encourage you to think what you could do to improve the environment and address climate change. Some ways to help a local habitat flourish or reduce your carbon footprint include planting a tree, growing a bee-friendly garden, riding your bike for shorter trips, taking transit more often, or consider purchasing an electric vehicle. Did you know the Brampton 2040 vision calls for the planting of 1 million trees by 2040 to grow the urban forest, mitigate and adapt to climate change, and foster the delivery of ecosystem services. In February 2020, Brampton Council approved the Brampton 1 Million Trees Program, a framework for the city and its partners to increase tree planting initiatives and realize the target of 1 million trees by 2040. Have you recently planted a tree? Let us know. The city has launched an online tree planting tracker tool to help monitor and report progress towards achieving the 1 million new tree goal. If you've recently planted a tree, record it on our tree planting tracker. Visit brampton.ca slash trees to learn how you can participate in your next neighborhood tree planting event. Let's head over to stop five with a message from proud program partner, Credit Valley Conservation. Hi, I'm Tuba Shaquille, Senior Coordinator of Sustainable Neighborhoods Program with Credit Valley Conservation. Credit Valley Conservation, or CVC, is a community-based environmental organization dedicated to protecting, restoring, and managing the Credit River watershed. Did you know that your neighborhood is home to the Credit River? Your neighborhood is connected to the nearby Fletcher's Creek. Fletcher's Creek flows into Credit River that drains into Lake Ontario, which is an important natural resource and source of drinking water for many Ontarians. The Credit River watershed contains some of the most diverse landscapes in southern Ontario, including natural areas like creeks, forests, and wetlands in urban neighborhoods. 
CVC is leading several initiatives in Brampton in partnership with municipalities and community members like yourself with support from several funders and partners. One such initiative going on right now is called the Community Tree Project. As part of this project, we are working with local residents and community members to add cooling tree cover to parts of your neighborhood and contribute towards Brampton's goal of planting 1 million trees by 2040. We encourage you to explore your neighborhood safely to discover natural areas in your neighborhood that connect you to the beautiful Credit River. To learn more about CVC and to get involved, please visit us at cvc.ca. Thank you. Feeling safe in our neighborhoods is important to everyone, and I'm thankful our program has a partner like Peel Regional Police, who work to help make our communities a safer place. Their crime prevention team is armed with numerous tips to help keep you and your loved ones safe. They can present to schools, businesses, places of worship, or other community events to help educate you and fellow community members. Visit peelpolice.ca slash crime prevention to learn more. I wanted to thank you for joining the virtual tour of your Fletcher's West neighborhood. Let's hear more from our mayor and local counselors. Hello, I'm Mayor Patrick Brown, and I want to thank you for taking the Nurturing Neighborhoods virtual tour today. This program is all about empowering you, our residents. Hi everyone, I'm your city councillor, Jeff Bowman, and I want to thank our sponsors for the Nurturing Neighborhoods program, Electra and Enbridge Gas. Tell us what you love about your neighborhood and what you wish was there and what can be improved by simply dropping a pin on the online mapping tool. Hi everyone, I'm Regional Councillor Martin Medeiros for Wards 3 and 4. The Nurturing Neighbourhoods program also connects residents with resources and I want to say thank you to our program partners, Peel Regional Police, Region Appeal, Toronto Region Conservation Authority and the Credit Valley Conservation. Help us see your neighbourhood through your eyes by completing the neighbourhood survey. I hope this virtual tour has motivated you to become more engaged in your neighborhood and I look forward to seeing your comments. Visit brampton.ca backslash neighborhoods and share your ideas with us. This is your city and as we continue to grow and develop, we want to make sure that your aspirations for your neighborhood are met. We work for you at the City of Brampton.